Hi friends, welcome back to week four. This is kind of a bittersweet week because it's our last week with Shanna teaching our class. I enjoy her teaching because, you know, I get a little crazy sometimes. <laughs> it's true. So, um, we were just so, thank you so much for coming and Thanks for having me. Guest it's teaching. Fun. Yeah, it's so fun to see people's different styles and things. And I have to say that this week is my favorite. These are my, these are my two favorite pages that we're doing. They've just got so many cute little details. The cute trailer and then our cute little Olive the Owl. That's and my favorite, yeah. too. The cute little cute. She wants to hang out in there with her scrapbook supplies. <laughs> so, this is my favorite week, so we will get at it. All right, moving on to page eight. This is the back of a cute fishing hat, and Chris will show you a close-up of the page. This one, this came out of the Noteworthy set, Sand at the Edges. This Stick it on towards the left of the, oops, I'm going backwards, upside down. At least you cut yourself before I did. you actually stuck it on. Yeah. That never happens, actually. All right, stick that on, and then my favorite, favorite piece in the Noteworthy set, this cute little darling camper with this little sunflowers. I'm so in love with this. This one, we have to make sure we get some dimension, so I'm going to throw some more pop dots on the back of it. So he stands up off the page. Or I, said, I should say she, because she's too pretty to be a he. Exactly. <laughs> All right. And it's okay if that one comes kind of off the page a little bit. It's actually cute that way. Okay. All right. And then more of our fun new flowers, new flowers petals. Yeah. petals. And a button from the button set. I like the jewels. Pearls? Yeah, pearls. That's the pearl from the jewels. I like, just wanted to make the center of the flower a little different, so let's stick the pearl on the button. Move that up down to the center of the flower. And then one more to enter him to the Stop. And then I'm just kind of took him back in there behind the camper. So cute. cute. All right. Tag. Also from the noteworthy set. Love this. All those fun alphabet stickers. Gotta use those in, in the album somehow, some way. They're just a lot of fun. Spell out the word home. And you'll have enough left over that you can journal and label all kinds of things throughout your album because there's lots of letters. Yes, make the um, album fit your family or your experience or the name of the place that you camped or however you make it work for you. All right, add the tag. Pop it up off the page so we can add our brown hemp bow. Tags don't have to be attached or tied to anything specifically to still be cute. So this tag's going to sit up here like this, and we're going to always adhere the tag first because it's it'll stay still for me while I tie my bow instead of trying to tie the bow on before I stick it down. Makes it a lot easier that way. With a good base. little pink bow bunny scissors of course and then out in the woods sticker just slide it here under home out in the woods cute super simple quick love it Fun. all right last page page nine I am in love with all the noteworthy pieces. This die cut is super cute. We're just going to stick now. You can use this for journaling or you can still in that spot stick a photo down. It's up to you. Make it work how you need to. Okay. And then 
I'm in love with this cute little owl. I, me too. Now, of the big 12 by 12 chipboard. I call shoes. her Olive. Oh, you name all the animals in the sets, do you? I name my stickers. Cute. It's okay, right? Yes. Stranger things have happened. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm going to tie a bow around this branch, too. It's all about the details. It really right. is. And that all goes down right here. Okay, so I've added the little brown hemp bow to the branch where this cute little owl is. He comes off the chipboard, 12 by 12 chipboard. And then you can just start adding the other cute fun details. The This little fire comes off the same chipboard set. So we'll add him in the bottom right corner. I like this cute little fire, but like I said, I'm a dimensional person, so I like the big chunky chipboard down there. And then, got to add some gold bling to the fire, a little pearl out of the jewel set. Just a fun little detail. Start adding your little word strips, sticker strips, venture. Fire. Now, I originally put um, chipboard, I'm sorry, pop dots on these too for dimension, but you don't, like I said, you don't have to always add that if you don't want to, so I'll leave it off for options. We're giving options. you options. Yes. So it's still cute even if you don't add that. The camp sticker. And then the exploring sticker up here underneath the owl. Thank you for shopping Cute. This little star comes out of the noteworthy set, and I've got to pop that on that one, so I'm just going to stick him up here. Add another little gold pearl. And two more little stars out of the noteworthy set. There's so many cute little fun details die cut inside of that set. Now, I don't have these sanded, but you can sand them if you want, or you can leave them plain. It's all cute. There you go. Nice. Hey. Adorable. There it is. Oh, down a little bit. Perfect. All done. All right, you guys, that wraps it up. You are done with this adorable camping album. So all of you go out and spend some time in nature and put some pictures in your albums. And then please come and share them with us on our Facebook. Um, and make sure you visit us on our blog, www.bobunny.blogspot.com where you're at right now watching the video. Just that I tell you where you were. Um, <laughs> sometimes I'm dorky. Um, anyway, so that is it. Thank you again. Thanks and we'll see you guys next month. Thanks. Bye.